Hello guys, uh, welcome back to IBT 101. If you're new to the channel, my name is Jose Cruz and I do create general content. So feel free to check out uh, my playlist uh, to see all my content after finishing watching this video. So in today's video, I'm going to pack my BMX to go back home because today is the D-Day. Just a couple of hours to depart. So sit back and let's begin. And we are back. As you can see, magic. We are ready to start packing. So I already opened it up. I keep everything in place. So now I'm gonna get started with a bike. As you can see, I just uh, removed the front uh, fork, front wheel, and also uh, the handbar, leaving mounted the seat all the way down and also the rear wheel on. Also, I uh, took out all the air out of the tops, so just to prevent uh, the wheels to explode uh, during the flight. So let's get started. Got this side. If you haven't checked out yet my previous video, I I did a, a review about this bag, so you can go and check it out at any time. Um, also, another thing that I want to mention is I put this uh, foam on the front side and I secured it with tape to prevent any damages because at the airports they throw everything so let's pack it up as you can see down here there's the plastic you can bring your bike all the way back to secure it in there then place it back in I was going to remove the cable but I just leave it so it has this is straps Make sure to strap on to secure it. So what I will do is I will do a torn around the frame and then click, keep it safe and it place. I will do the same thing, the upper side. This bag is awesome, honestly. Here we have this long uh, strap. I will place it through the spokes and to this side. Also, we'll give a turn around the frame like this to keep it secure. Another thing that I did is I removed the the pedals and I place it inside my my riding shoes and the pegs I will put it inside too so let's cover it up you can see you can close it like this then I'm gonna place the handbars right here right in between and also with the forks I grab two extra socks and I cover it up to prevent any damages any scratches because this bike is still pretty new so I put it on and then I secure it with tape also I put everything in order uh, both bearings, uh, the lower bearing and the upper bearing and the rest of the pieces. I put everything in and then I secure it up here so it won't come out to keep it everything in the same place. So let's bring it in. Then uh, let's bring the another wheel. right here then this bag has a lot of room so 
I'm gonna place my shoes here somewhere. Let me put it right here. My helmet, my estrambotic knee, pa uh, knee brace. Without this, I can't ride. And also, I will bring an extra tube, my Allen's, and my pegs on this side. By the way, I received these pegs. I'm gonna give it a try when I am at my home. They are so, so cool. Violet color, so let me put it in. A tip, if you're going to Puerto Rico or if you're going to anywhere else, make sure to clean up your bike because the Department of Agriculture of Puerto Rico, at least, uh, they are a kind of picky, especially with something that comes with dirt or animals or insects or bugs or fruits, all of that. So make sure to clean it up, to clean it up. So I use uh, these tissues, it worked pretty good, so you can secure it. And also, the last thing that I will add is my clothing that will go right here. And here is uh, my clothing. As you can see, it looks like a, like a pillow. Actually, I always travel with this kind of uh, compression bags. They are amazing. You can put a lot of clothes in, and you can zip it up, keep it tight, keep it organized. So here I have uh, my clothing uh, bag and inside I have a small bag for other uh, stuff like underwear and socks. So that's it. I'm ready to travel. So let me close it for you guys. By the way, sometimes people put a, a lock on the zipper. It's up to you. Anyways, they're gonna open it. Every zipper is easy to open it. So always keep everything in place. Let me move the wheel a little bit down. There it is. Now it's untied. Let's tie it up. I'm ready to go. Last thing to mention, if you're going to Puerto Rico on this season, make sure to have a copy test uh, with, on the previous 72 hours. I will leave you uh, the descriptions because what happens if you get to Puerto Rico without a copy test, you can be fined three, uh, $300 for not having it unless they are given the opportunity to uh, have uh, to make a test in there uh, but you have to prove it if you don't do it it's gonna be $300 fine so that was all for today's video look at this baby it's everything packed it has wheels so I don't have to carry by hand because well as you can see this is awesome look at this look at this it's almost my height. <laughs> so I have everything in place. This is the All They See uh, travel bag. It's uh, intended, as I mentioned before in the, my previous video, it's a, it has been built for 20, uh, BMX 20 side. So if, you're, if you think it's going to fit in, in something higher, don't waste your time and money because it won't fit. It's, it's, it has been made for uh, size 20. Looks good. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe, share with your friends, and hit the notification bell so you will be the first to get my future content. Have fun. Happy riding. Be safe. Take care, guys. I love you all. See you next time.